Uh, yes, so in uh, 2016, I was um, uh, studying uh, uh, Persian uh, in Tehran. Uh, well, I was also doing uh, interrogated me for three, four hours before letting me go uh, and telling me I, I, I would not be able to go home uh, for now and I should wait for their call. You know, in the very beginning, uh, uh, there wasn't really any charges. It's, it just appeared to be a, some sort of a regular uh, questioning by authorities. I was thrown into a, a solitary confinement. Um, it was uh, uh, um, about 15 feet by 8 feet. Um, um, and then the, uh, I, I, I went around the, the cell. Uh, there were scribbles on the wall. Uh, and I saw somebody wrote 364 days on the wall. And I just uh, 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 collapsed uh, in, immediately. The interrogator, in fact, told me that he, uh, you know, uh, he wanted to use me as a pawn uh, uh, to make a deal with America to get Iranian prisoner and the money, uh, a frozen asset, back to Iran. Uh, in order to do that, I, I interrogation basically um, uh, the, in, towards the back to solitary uh, until you confess. If you don't confess, you'll never be able to go back to America. And said your food American saw you, will never be able to see your wife and son. It doesn't really matter what kind of message that U.S. Uh, you know the message of reconciliation or rapprochement uh, the U.S. wants to convey to Iran return of U.S. prisoners. And no matter you know what Obama administration will call that, that money was understood as a ransom, mm -hmm. and that money encouraged uh, you know Obama's appeasement and the payment of ransom. Let's say uh, you know let's put it that way. Price that he, he can ask. So technically, I think this is wrong. Mm -hmm. uh, I think I think I think the the the, the current administration should uh, uh, maintain pressure and uh, um, press Iran. Uh, to negotiate a more comprehensive deal. Uh, Saudi Arabia, Israel, and UAE, these countries should not be left uh, out of the, 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 the negotiation. Their interests have to be in, uh, taken into account. Okay, okay, so, so uh, that's a good question. I'm not saying that the U.S. shouldn't make a, a, a tactical compromise. The problem, the problem is when you release, uh, when you do exchange, and then there, there should be consequence also afterwards for the for the Iranian perpetrators who took, uh, or, you know, who take hostages. Um, and then when there's no consequence for them, of course they will do this again.